Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Reviews. And this is my 738th Energy Drink Review video. It's 8.09 p.m. And it's Sunday, October 30th, 2016. Today I'm going to be reviewing the third one of these Bi Bubbles Sparkling Antioxidant Infusion. Like drinks, I got from Walgreens. They're on sale for two for three dollars, so they're cheap. Um, but when they're not on sale, they're a little bit expensive. I'm not going to lie. But anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Bolivia Black Cherry one. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Look at that. Clean wrapped can. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention my last review is a wrapped can. All these buy drinks are like plastic wrapped cans. Like there's plastic around it. I don't know what's underneath them because I only bought like one of each. But I might buy more and take off the wrapper to see what's underneath them. I'm not for sure yet though. It has a black top with a red tab. It has a leaf on it. Bi Bubbles Sparkling Antioxidant Infusion. Bolivia Black Cherry, 5 calories per can. And shows some black cherries. 1 gram of sugar, no artificial sweeteners, antioxidant beverage. 11.5 fluid ounces, 340 milliliters. Rebellious flavor that tastes so fresh you'll want to slap its face. Yeah. Buy bubbles with 5 calories and just 1 gram of sugar. This flavor tends to play by its own delicious rules. And that's perfectly fine with us. We always like the bad bubbles anyway. They look good in a leather jacket. Yeah, renegade style. Hashtag I'm a renegade, you know what that, what that means. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Buy Bubbles Bolivia Black Cherry, distributed by Buy Brands LLC, Trenton, New Jersey, 08609, copyright 2015. Buy Brands LLC, RH Reserved. Phone number is 855-4114-BUY-DRINK-BUY.COM. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and Pinterest logos. Hashtag Drink Buy. Contains 1% juice, 5 calories per serving. And... The bottom has the enjoy by date. It's March 25th, 2017. Um, nutrition facts. Serving size 1 can. Amount per serving. Calories 5. Total fat 0 grams, 0%. Sodium 10 milligrams, 0%. Total carbohydrates 11 grams, 4%. Sugars 1 gram. Erythritol 10 grams. Protein 0 grams. Vitamin C 20%. Excellent source of vitamin C. 1 net carb per serving. Erythritol carbs have no calories or effect on blood sugar. Antioxidants, 15 mg vitamin C, also contains 70 mg polyphenols and chlorogenic acid from coffee fruit extract and white tea extract. Ingredients, it has bi-proprietary sweetener blend, erythritol and stevia extract. It has cherry juice concentrate, fruit and vegetable juice for color, coffee fruit extract, white tea extract. Has SKU Nature's Caffeine, 45 milligrams per can, like a cup of green tea. No artificial preservatives, gluten-free, low glycemic, non-GMO, kosher, vegan, and soy-free. So yeah, so I'll let you see the can now. It has like a gray and white pattern on the can. It looks pretty cool. Well, I don't know if I should say on the can, because it's like a plastic wrapper, but you know what I mean? Oh, look at those cherries. This one's probably going to be really good. Definitely, it's probably going to be better than the last one I reviewed, the grapefruit one. Because I'm not too big of a fan of grapefruit. I liked the blood orange one, though. That was pretty good, actually. And my cat's up my window wanting in. So I might pause it in a minute.
okay. Hope we can see this okay. Okay. Hopefully you can see it now. There's the ingredients. Um, sorry about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's basically the whole can. Anyway, I'm going to shake it up, open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I opened it, and it was bubbling a little bit. It exploded a little bit when I opened it, too. Because, you know, it's sparkling. You know, I shouldn't shake them up because they're sparkling, but you know what I mean? I do it anyway. I'm a renegade. The smell, it's definitely cherry. It smells like, um... Um... I don't know why, but it smells like the raspberry monster rehab a little bit. Even though that's raspberry and this is supposed to be cherry. I'm not really for sure why. It smells like that, though. Smells a little bit like the Petey's Bing energy drink. And... Mm, the cherry amp a little bit. And also like the black cherry Mountain Dew kickstart. You know, it's like a black cherry smell. It's like cherry, but a little bit darker. Yeah, it smells pretty good. Now I'm going to pour it in my cup right quick. And then I'll show you the color. So hold on a minute. Okay, I poured it in my cup, and it's like really bubbly, and it's like a pinkish color. Can't really tell because of my lighting, though. But the liquid's like a reddish-purple color. I want you to be able to see it without me spilling it. Yeah, 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 like a pinkish-reddish color. You know what I mean? Now the bubbles are starting to go away. It's like a darkish-reddish color, purplish yeah, you know what I mean? But anyway, it's, it looks good and smells good. I might like this one. And I'm going to try it. Wow. Sweet. A little bit tart. And tangy. Really good. Smooth tasting. Black cherry flavor, it's really good. I like it better than the Black Cherry Mountain Dew Kickstart. Also, the Cherry Amp. Yeah, I think it tastes most similar to the Petey's Bing Cherry Energy Drinks. Also, it tastes a little bit like the Raspberry Monster Rehab a little bit. But it's supposed to be just cherry, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. And the white tea aftertaste that the other two ones had, it's not as noticeable on this one, so that's good. Because, like, an aftertaste, it would be normally that weird white tea aftertaste. That was in the Jamaica Blood Orange one, and the last one I reviewed, the, I think it was the Gimba Pink Grapefruit, or whatever. I like weird, nasty aftertaste. This one doesn't. sweet. It does have a little bit of that sugar-free taste to it, though. I forgot to mention the other ones are also... They're not really sugar-free because they have one gram of sugar, but it's like low sugar, so sort of like a sugar-free drink. But it has that 10 grams of erythritol, though. That's high. I'm not gonna lie. The Monster Ultras only have one gram. And these have 10 grams. And the Venoms have like 8 grams. So I thought the Venoms were high, but this is, like, higher in the Erythritol. So that's, like, weird. But I like the Black Cherry one, though. It's really good. Okay, now I'm going to try it out of the can. Okay. 
I like it, this one better out of the cup than in the can. Yeah, it's a sweet and tart black cherry flavor. It's really good and I like it. Highly recommend you trying this one. It's good. It was cheap. Well, it was cheap when they're on sale at Walgreens. It's like two for three dollars. They're normally more expensive though. But I also found these at Warehouse Market. And I think Walmart has some of them. So yeah. But anyway, this is good. It tastes good. It's cheap if they're on sale. I like the can design. It's like clean and like doesn't take too long for me to show off the can. And it's cool. It's in like a wrapped can, so it's like soft and smooth. And the wrap also helps it from like getting dents and stuff. You can still like get big dents if you like squeeze it really hard, but like small dents it like protects it from it. So that's cool. But yeah, I like it energy wise. It doesn't have a lot of the energy drink stuff in it. So I'll say energy wise, it lasts about 30 minutes to about an hour and a half at the most. So it could have been better energy wise, but still it tastes good. Um, I like the can design, and it's pretty good. I like it. I'm going to give the Bolivia Black Cherry Bi Bubble Sparkling Antioxidant Infusion Drink. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. It's good, and I highly recommend you trying it. I just wish it had more of the energy drink stuff in it, because then it would be really good. But yeah, I give it a 9 out of 10. So yeah. My next review is going to be my last Bi Bubbles drink review for a while. I know there's other flavors, but I only bought four flavors. So, you know. So, I'll have to get the other ones to review. But, yeah, my next review is going to be the last of them for now. Stay tuned for that review. Stay tuned for my upcoming reviews. Stay tuned for more reviews. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out and bye.